What's up everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today we're playing mission number three, but before we start, we're gonna head over here to Power Ups, down to Alistor, and get this uh, first upgrade, because the guy that I'm following says this makes it easier to get one of the blue orb fragments in this level, so yeah. Anyways, let's hop right into this mission. All right. I really need to figure out how to like dodge and stuff. Okay. I don't know how I just did that to be honest. Okay. R1 and then left, right, jump. And now it's not working. Yeah, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Let's go interact with this thing. The pride of line is granted only to those who choose the path of trials. Oh, oops. I probably should have figured out how to use that thing I just bought because I have no idea to be honest. All right, let's head out the, these doors right here. Down the stairs. I think the fragment is somewhere over here. I don't know exactly where it is, but I don't even know if it's like spawned in yet. I might have to do this first. I like how this bridge just kind of leads out to nothing over here. We do have some red orbs here, though, which I think are five each. What's this? This symbol resembles the staff of Hermes that's used in the art of alchemy. Hmm. I can feel some kind of mysterious force, but I just can't quite understand yet. Sorry, I'm like talking. Oh, no. I could have been pressing circle through all that. Sorry, I'm a terrible reader, by the way. <laughs> all right. Now we can interact with this thing. Say it's go back to the path. Thou shall... Return from the abyss with thy line heart and thou shall receive the pride of line. Okay, I already said a reading when it comes to old English. I, I'm even worse. Um, just a little update. I'm still missing the seven out of seven for this. I think it's the six paragraph for this. But we will be able to get this mission as long as I do it right. So hopefully I do that. Well, that's uh, unlucky. <laughs> Get hit by lightning. And it just destroys the whole bridge. Nice. All right. So we come through here. We're constantly getting health taken away, apparently, in this area. Okay. Wait. I think that's all you have to do. I think once these spawn in. Yeah, okay, two out two. Once they spawn in, and then once you start getting, like, bit by these things. Dude, can I get out of here, please? Yeah, once he starts to bite you, I think you get the second one, and then just them spawning in alone gets you, uh... The first entry for it. Get out of here. I think we just come here. Okay, cool. They give you a full heal. Alright, so before we head back in, we're actually gonna come back across here. Go, go, go! That was close. Go, go, go! Oh, I just fell. All right, I think we just fight these things again, right? Yeah, okay. Get out of here. So you get multiple chances to get the two entries, but you should get your first try as long as you let them like attempt to bite you. Hopefully we get the health though. Okay, we do. Well, and you grab it. Go, go, go. Okay, I spawned us over here anyways. Okay, here's the first blue thing for this level. All right, now we got to get back across without falling again. Hopefully we can do that. I just don't, I don't like that it doesn't show like your uh, shadow when you jump so you can't like fully know where you are. Go, go, go. Oh, God. 
Okay, made it. All right, I think we can see the thing up there. It's that floating piece up there. I just, I really don't know how to get it. I might have to pause and try to figure this out real quick. Yeah, I'm going to pause real quick. Okay, I think I figured it out. We can climb up this part and get up here if I do it right, right there. And then that's where you need to use the thing, but I honestly don't know how. Nope. Well, I just used that on accident, which is kind of unfortunate because now I uh, lost some of it for the fight. Go, go, go. Okay, I need to figure out how to use my ability real quick. Okay, I think I almost just hit it. The ability thing I've bought does not seem to be working, but I think you can do that and grab it. I'm just... Kind of missing it, so hopefully I can get one of these tries. Get it. Okay, I'm just gonna, that's like the idea of how to get it. I'm just gonna pause and then cut back to when I do get it. I got it. And I used the ability, I think. Okay, so six. Uh, just gotta mark that down real quick. I think that's where I four, so yeah. Get a full orb. All right. So the way I did it, jump up here, line up in the middle, face towards the platform, hold R1, and then press triangle, and it kind of flings you up there. That's crazy. So that's the ability I bought, by the way. But yeah, now we can actually continue. Sorry, I was reading something I thought it was a cussing. Alright. Pride of Line, a sign of the strong. It allows confrontation with the line gatekeeper. This is a boss fight. Let's go. I just totally. Oh God. Okay. So this guy also has the enemy file thing. I think I got a couple right there. I got right here. He has seven. I got four out of seven. I got one, two, three, and six, I think. One of them's just for starting it. One of them's for when he used his first attack with the fireball. One of them's for me attacking when his mouth open. And then, and then it looks like the other one is for him trying to attack me with his tail. All right. So for the next two, you can only get six out of seven here from what this guy says. Um, I want to keep like dodging him, I guess. Okay, that's another one right there. Sorry, I know it's annoying me going into this. Okay, yeah, so the last one should be, um... Let me see real quick. I need to jump above his body and slash downward onto it with Alistair. Okay. Okay, so like that. Boom. Hopefully that did. Tell me that did, please. If I can pause. No, that didn't work. Okay. 
Get away from me. Okay, that didn't hit apparently. Dude, come on. There we go. That work? Please tell me that worked. Okay, that worked. Okay. Okay, so now we can just fight this guy normal. Get him. Okay, that wasn't smart. I kind of just wasted that. Dude, I don't know how to like hurt this guy a lot. Stay away from me. Looks like that was it. I remember that being so much more harder. I don't know if I ever actually beat that uh, boss as a kid. All right. So next up, before we like continue on with the story, we can come back out here. I don't know if we actually have to go across this, but like there's a little secret mission here. If you just hop off the edge right here, puts us back underwater. And so this is the first secret mission. Um, this is also where we're, we have a second chance of completing the uh, Sin Scissor enemy file. So we're going to go for that. Basically, what I was doing wrong is I have to wait for him to attack with the scissors. And then I have to parry him by hitting the scissors in his hands and then shoot him with the shotgun right next to him. And we got to be very careful because our health is going down all the way or constantly. Okay. So wait for him to. Come on, dude. Do better attack for me. Okay, I needed to jump there. Oh, I failed it. That's what you have to do, though. You have to be, like, right next to him to do it, though. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Dang it, dude. I'm not getting it. I'm gonna have to do this again, probably. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do this again. Let me up. Yeah, I need to do that again, dude. I failed. I don't know how I'm supposed to get full health though. So that kind of sucks. I think you have to do that to like actually successfully complete that mission too. So that's kind of rough. Am I still like no health right now? I could do this. I'm going to sit here for a second, get my health back and then jump back down. I'm not going to get full health or anything, but yeah. All right. Got a little bit of health back. I don't think you, from what I read, I don't think you actually f die when you, uh, when it reaches the bottom, as long as you don't get hit. So let's retry this. I had to pause there for a second, which kind of sucks as my health kept going down. I really hope I'm not going to die here. Okay, yeah, so you don't actually die. I just can't be hit by him. Come 
Come on, buddy. Yeah, that definitely wasn't close enough. I'm gonna restart. All right. Did I get it? No, I didn't. Oh God. Okay, I'm restarting again. Actually, I'll keep trying this. Yeah, no, it didn't work. Okay. Wait for it to do it again. Dang it. Dude, come on. Just let me get it game. I just don't know how to stay close to it because it seems like he gets too far away for me to do it. Dude, how is that not it? There we go. Okay, cool. So you parry it and then shove your shotgun into it and shoot and it gives it to you. Cool. That took me forever, so I was a little bit annoyed that one. Oh yeah, we finally uh, got it there. <laughs> secret mission cleared. Can you keep a secret? All right. So now that we finally did that, which I'll probably edit a lot of that out to be honest. Whoops. I did not mean to just fall. All right, cool little fact. After you complete the secret mission, it puts you with the skulls again. So I actually got health back from that. So that was actually pretty good. Because I don't know if this mission is actually any longer. Since it was kind of a boss mission, so it might not have anything else. Let's just see real quick. All right, cool. That was the mission. I'm probably going to edit a lot of that out. Oh, we got another trophy, it looks like. So I had to mark that down. But yeah, I'll try to edit out all the nonsense there. I'm not too sure what I'm going to do yet. But anyways, that will do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.